Hello, so this is about activity number one on Git GitHub. So I'm here in my GitHub account, already signed in. So this is the dummy profile that I'm using. And uh, I go to this link over here that had been provided in activity number one. So I'll read through the readme file. And the first step says that first of all, start this repo so that you can keep a track of all the changes and the follow-up so that looks fine to me i'm gonna start it my first step completed then the next step is to click on fork which will create your copy of this repository so then i'm gonna go again and fork it so where should we fork i've chosen this my account it should take only a few seconds and let's wait so okay so this repository has been forked by us now now make changes to the readme.md in your forked repository fine so we have to make changes uh, what kind of changes let's see what changes to make in readme.md it's write the number write your name and then your github profile link fine so what's the fourth step once done make the commit with the message my fork commit or anything that you wish then next click on the pull request so let's try this third and the fourth step which is introducing this so I go to editing so I click on this blue link over here and then I go on to this pen type of icon to edit this file so I see there are many names and my name would come at the number 50 so I put in 50 here and then I'm gonna just write dummy and then without a space in parenthesis I'm gonna give the name of my github repository which is in just a second we'll see when you go to your profile you get the URL of your github and I've pasted it here then the fourth step was my first commit to be written as the commit message i'm done with it as you can see this is the name and these are the commit changes so i'm gonna click on commit changes now the last step was the last step was that click on the pull request tab that has that will be available to you after your commit on the next page click on create pull request so now you would see that after committing it will show that my first commit your message in here and uh, your latest commit and all this so also you'll see one message that this branch is one commit ahead of your master branch so just click on pull request from over here and click on create pull request the fifth step and then simply on create pull request so this branch is no conflicts with the base branch and you are done so we'll go to our master repo again and we'll see that indeed we have our pull request over here and you will see your name and now let the master that is Ojusvi let her merge it with the repo so this is all hope you learned how to edit a readme and create a pull request so thanks for watching